Hi everyone, it's me. I have to wear a hat because my hair is ridiculously messy. messy. Right, two things today. Me and Will is not okay, so Will are going to do a collaboration at Stella's birthday party on the 28th of March. So look out for that on my channel and his channel because we'll be doing two videos, hopefully. Second thing, I'm going down south to, she to see Shay and a couple of other people, of course. And yeah, I get to see Shay and I'm going to do a vlog on my phone to, um, a vlog on my phone, a vlog on my phone of us being united again, because I have not seen her since Christmas and I need to see her, I need to see her, wait, when was that, yeah, I need to see her, I miss her, I was like, was going to miss two weeks. But luckily, my brother is a lifesaver and come pick me up and take me down to see Shay and my family, of course, and a couple of other people. Um, but yeah, I've had questions of people at school, am I single? And yeah, talk about being gay. Right, I am single. I'm proud of being single right now because my, my ex-girlfriend's a bitch. Second thing. Right, being who I am is me, and I'm proud to be me, because it took me a while to figure out who I am, and I'm a lot stronger than I thought I was, my, my feelings can't be broken as quick as others, like, my eyebrow keeps going up, right, coming out is different to different, like, coming out is like a massive part of you and coming out to your family maybe just like pressure taken away from you you might be it's different because families families um families agree like take take your side and they support you. Other families don't as much. They don't like it. They won't support you. Luckily, I have the great family that supports me whatever I do. But it's not as easy as that. Coming out is probably the most hardest thing I've ever done to my family. I just went away from them. To my family. It's so hard. I never thought it would be like really hard to come out to my family. I've been hiding away that I've been gay for two years. And it's just like, hi, I'm gay, what up? Um, but yeah, like, I might be gay, and what? I am who I am, don't judge. If you're like, I know this is like really cliche, but if you're being bullied because of who you are, then you're being more honest than the people are bullying you. Because not everyone is who they actually are. For instance, at school, People are so different, it's unbelievable. Like, I'm a different person at school than I am here on YouTube at home. Because we build up barriers to defend ourselves, to stop us getting hurt. That when we, when someone actually does break down that barrier, that you don't feel comfortable. But coming out to your friends or your family is like, you've run, you've gone over a hurdle. Sorry for my speech, it's been a pain today. Um, but yeah, it's so different. It's, my life's changed a lot. Like, for instance, like, everything has changed a lot. Everything's changed a lot. My, my life has changed. I told my parents I had a girlfriend. And they supported me, but we, we broke up, unfortunately. Um, but yeah, it's so different. Now I'm reaching out to you. I know it might be hard. It it might not come out as much as you want it to. But your parents still love you for who you are. And your friends, if they leave you, they're not real friends. But the true friends stick with you no matter what. That might be cliche, but have you met me? <laughs> no, but yeah, that's all I've really got to say, like, be you, be who you are. 
just live your life, mate. You only have one life. Live it. It took me a long time to learn that. It may be easy for me to say it, but it's a lot harder to learn. Just enjoy your life. This has just took a weird turn. <laughs> um, yeah. This topic was very hard for me to talk about. Because, as you saw in my last video, I did a little bit about me and I just said, I'm gay. And then moved on to the next one. Because it's hard for me to explain how how difficult it is to be in a society that judges. For instance, like I've had people at school that are homophobic, but it doesn't let me judge me. Because as you saw in my last video, I said my mum had a brain tumour. That's actually made me a stronger person because I was seven. I've been so different and I've looked at life a different way that I've actually took the right path of coming out and yeah, people may judge you, people may call you names, but they're the one that have the problem, you're not.